Operational research is all about helping people to make informed decisions. Very often in the health service and in other industries, people make decisions without any evidence or with very limited or poor evidence. And actually by applying some modeling, simulation, data analysis techniques, we can help people to make better decisions. And we can do that by showing them what the impact of making those decisions might be. All of our projects start with the health service. People from uh, the NHS approach us and explain that they have a particular problem. It might be uh, cues in the system, it might be that they want to take a decision and they don't know what's going to happen. So our starting point is to talk to those people in the NHS. All of our projects take place very quickly. We understand that problems in the health service need to be sorted very quickly in very tight timescales. So all of our projects take place within three months. And in that time we can do some really useful things. Uh, we can give people the ability to make better decisions, and better decisions means better services, more efficient services, and in some cases, uh, patient lives saved. One of our chief aims uh, as part of Pencord and as part of the Clark is to build capacity to actually do some of these things uh, within the NHS. So one of the key things that we've been doing over the last few years is to run a training programme which is available to anyone working in and around the health service completely free of charge and what we can do is to teach people some simple modelling, simulation, analysis techniques that they can do in their own organisations to just try and help make better informed decisions. In addition to that, we also run a seminar series every two months where we have an open invitation to anyone who wants to come along and hear more about our work locally and also more about the potential of operational research methods to apply to the health service.